The Teespring Launcher makes it easy to upload and preview your designs on different products. Check out our top tips to help you optimize your design's print quality as you create new products in the Teespring Launcher. First up is your file type. We always recommend using high quality PNG files with a transparent background. When it comes to artwork dimensions, we recommend using designs that are true to size. This means creating the same dimensions as the real printable area of the product. You can double check the printable area dimensions of a product by resizing your artwork once you've uploaded it into the launcher. Although artwork dimensions are important, it's the image resolution that we really want you to pay attention to in the launcher. We recommend creating designs with a DPI of 300, that's dots per inch. The higher the DPI, the higher resolution or quality your image will be. The minimum DPI the launcher will accept is 120. If your image resolution is too low, we'll let you know before you can proceed to the next step of creating your listing. If your design features text, you'll want to make sure that it's legible once printed. For this reason, we recommend using fonts that are at least 10 points or larger. The color system you should use depends on your design goal. Teespring's printers use an RGB workflow, so if bright, saturated colors is your goal, then use RGB. Just note that printers do have a limited color gamut, and it's not possible to reproduce every single color, so we don't recommend using overly bright colors like neons. If color accuracy is your main priority, then the CMYK color space is recommended. We have some new recommendations for file formatting based on recent updates our team has implemented. If you want to ensure a cleaner, crisper print around the edges of your design, you should export your design files with anti-aliasing turned off. I'll show you how to do this in Illustrator and Photoshop. In Photoshop, there's no option for turning anti-aliasing on or off because the images are already rasterized. Instead, make sure the setting called Nearest Neighbor Hard Edges is selected as the resampling method in the Image Size Settings. In Illustrator, when exporting a PNG, the last dialog box contains the option for turning anti-aliasing on or off. Make sure to select None before exporting. So there you have it, our top six tips to ensure the best quality print for your products. Visit Teespring's YouTube channel now for more video tutorials. Thanks for watching.